1996, the year our world turned to ashes. The atomic flame, unleashed by the leaders of the East and West, like a genie from his bottle, circled the globe in a mere minutes and devoured it to the bone. Without sparing neither the innocent nor the guilty, without naming a victor to the bloody war, a nuclear blaze destroyed everything in its path, including the reasons for the conflict that sent the remnants of humanity back into the dark ages, back into the primeval state with no government, no technology, no culture, and no morals. Two thousand and fifth. Nineteen years have passed from the day of the Great Purge. Both once glorious empires and their loyalists now lie in ruins. However, amidst the ruins, new civilizations start to rise up to the unforgiving sun. From the rusted radioactive derelict of the old world, new absent states, both brave and wild emerge to join the never-ending battle for the right to exist on the planet, mutilated beyond recognition by the flames of apocalypse. Hey guys, Barry here, and welcome back to IGS, and welcome to Atom RPG. And a massive thank you to the Atom team for this hands-on. Now I'm talking quietly because it's late at night time and there's people asleep, so you have to. <laughs> uh, settings here. Okay. Oh, special code for Kickstarter. Oh. wonder if I can get one of those codes. <laughs> yeah, so this game came out in Steam originally. And, uh, yeah, big shout out to my friend Sarah as well. Sarah, I love you. So, strength here. What's this now? We can change our... Oh, we can change our picture and our name as well. Valentina. Anything look like me, perhaps? Probably not. Okay. Okay, we'll just go for this guy. I don't know. So can we do anything here, or... Bodice. Yeah, we'll give Boris because, uh, <laughs> James Bond. <laughs> so let's go create. Close kit, we'll have a traveler. We'll do easy. Multiple new players, you get more experience points, you get a bigger chance of avoiding random encounters. Okay, let's start. So, I'm first time playing this, just want to, you know, I guess take it easy. Like every game I play. <laughs> yeah, but what you're watching now, hopefully, is the exclusive first look at this game running on Switch. So, yeah, that's pretty exciting, I guess. All exciting to see new games first on the channel.
you have a peculiar dream. Red stars glow in the sky and giant mushrooms rise to the heavens as horn shadows dance at the edge of an ancient forest. Suddenly, darkness falls. The images are eclipsed within a black void as it surrounds you. As it billows closer and closer like impenetrable smoke, as it rubs against your, bod, uh, your body like a cat, it is soothing, calming, before, devouring you. You swallow a thick lump of saliva and look around fr uh, frantically. You see nothing unusual. You're in the barracks for agents about to, deployed, about to be deployed on field work. A man is standing near you. He looks worried. Have a nightmares, huh, cadet bars? Even yesterday's storm didn't wake you up. Right, right. Take all the rest you can before the mission. Eh, uh, what's the mission? That will be discussed during the final briefing. Come on, soldier, hip up. Who are you? Agent Alf of the Honey Eaters Brigade. Our leaders asked me to watch over you until your departure to make sure everything's a okay. So where am I? Are you pulling my leg? This is ground level of Adam HQ. Let me guess. Next you're going to ask what year it is and what sort of war we had 20 years ago. Actually, yes. You sure you didn't take it something to help you sleep last night, comrade crackhead? It's 2005. <laughs> Don't scare me like that. Okay. First get some food into your system. There are some biscuits on the table. Then we'll think about what to uh, do with you next. We still have some time before the briefing starts. Okay, let's eat something. That's the spirit. Hold on. Okay, one, two. Just checking the levels. <laughs> Knock yourself out on those biscuits. No soup for you, though. You slept through, uh, straight through serving time in the mess hall. Honestly, not a huge loss. Between you and me, it was pretty crap. <laughs> so there was a biscuit on the table. Approach the highlight and press A to take it. Okay. You took the biscuit. Press plus button to open the inventory. Okay. Nice. So what's the controls here? Have we got controls perhaps or... That's cool. Well, then open the door. Let's go. <laughs> you yawn as you enter the next room and stop before a closed door. The agent scratches his unshaven neck. Wasteland habits never die. Whenever I get under a roof or shelter, I always attempt to barricade myself in. Like with this door, for example. I locked it on instinct. Even Never even bothered to remember where I stashed the key. Can you take a quick look around for it? A test? Well, if you struggle with opening the doors, then yes, this is a test. Hmm. <laughs> What's information here? Okay. Okay, so as you can see, we can take stuff. There's the keys there. Open your inventory, select the item, and press A to equip it into an active slot. Okay. Let's see what else. <laughs> what was there for certain? Oh, 
We'll insect the uh, the headphones here are, are just disconnecting on me. Bluetooth headphones. That's weird. I'll turn them off. Oh. Take a deep breath. The air of the assembly field is filled with the stench of machine oil and soldier sweat. Today only you and your colleagues stand here. I'll be honest with you, Boris. The wastes are no joke. Need to be prepared. Are you ready to do some training exercises before the briefing? Yeah. Okay, listen up. There are very strange spots around the courtyard. Pick any of them any one of them, and I'll train you as well as I can. While you've had enough, feel free to head into the main bunker. When you've had enough, okay, let's go. So to view your statistics, press up. To see followers' stats, push L button or OR. Okay. Yeah, I like the kind of old school vibe to it. Here, uh, as you already know, is the shooting gallery. Try and shoot some targets. Grab a weapon and put it in the active, into an active slot. To activate a non-hostile, press the Y button to give a weapon to a friend. To go, uh, go into your inventory, and then into the friend's inventory and press the LR button. Okay. Rubber bullets. Oh yeah. Oh, cool. We can zoom in as well. So if you press the uh, the analog stick on the right one, it will change. Wait, how do you use what happened again? <laughs> Oh, here we go. Nice one. Okay. Too far, really? That was terrible, so let's uh, reload. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wait, is he actually shooting me? Are we? I'm, only, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. <laughs> okay.
There we go. That's fine. So let's take this weapon. Oh, wrong. What are you doing? Okay. That was terrible. What the hell? So we got some, oh, we got some grenades, okay, here we go. Let's swap. <laughs> what the hell? What a dummy. Hey, some of you guys seem to be resting here. If you want, we can ask him for a quick sparing match. Okay, let's train. To issue co commands in co combat, hold A on a team member and switch to the command you want to issue. Okay. Why don't have no action points? What are you on about? Can you go here? That was terrible. Well, that's why. Stupid me. What, really? Oh, come on. Down one now.
<laughs> oh, so I can hit him. Okay. That's it. Nice one. Okay, so I actually understood that a bit more now. Let's head on over here, I guess. What's in here? That's our warehouse. Spring cleaning is going on right now, so there's not much stuff left, but the doors are still locked every day. Perfect place to practice lockpicking, eh? So attempt lockpicking, stand near, uh, next to the door. Select it, press it, okay. Open inventory and push the minus button to go to the crafting menu. Pick a bottle and a brick by pushing A on them and press right stick to make a primitive weapon. So we can craft stuff here as well. That's cool. Yeah, but what are we making though? <laughs> Okay. So what are we crafting now? So we can't even make any uh, shivs or anything or bags like. Okay. Let's ask for help. Anything special in here or... Oh, the safe is here. You don't even know the code. Yeah, we'll never get it. We'll never get it. So, uh, bullets is always handy. <laughs> Look at this Nimrod sleeping on duty. What would he do if an enemy gets inside the base? Damn it, hey. Boris, let's teach his sleepy head a lesson. Seal his gun from him. Okay, let's pick pocket him. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Picked a terrible time to take a nap, kid. If we were the enemy, your throat would have been this last minute ago. Give him back his uh Makarov bars. And if I catch you dozing off again, oh, you don't even want to know. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Can we talk to them? 
You see a middle-aged man frantically digging through the pockets of his uh, starched white lab coat. This is Dr. Zinovev. Zinovev, even. <laughs> a man you're, you've known since childhood. That's why you noticed the absence of his thick-rimmed glasses right away. Dang it, where did I put my glasses? Oh, hello there. Oh, hello there. Didn't notice you, cadet. That's a good thing. A stealthy soldier is a long-lived soldier, after all. Did you need something from me this beautiful morning? Okay, Jesus Christ, excuse me. Okay, that will soon be sent on a mission. Okay. I see someone learned his lesson too well. Let me guess. You'd like to ask me name, rank, thoughts, Adams. Hmm. <laughs> Pick the first one. Bit late to learn new tricks, I'm afraid, but what we learned. Okay. Okay. Let's take this med kit. We use it. That was a waste. Well, which way do we go? Okay, where's the man bunker now? Let's see. Okay. Some nice rubbish there we can use. So we actually can we craft a shiv? Yes, we can. What's that sound? Is your stomach growling? Well, I've got news. Good news. Somebody forgot his canned meat over there. You can warm it up on the campfire. Okay. You can push A. Okay, let's go. Let's cook. Nice one. Okay, let's go in here. Oh, hold on. Let's see this here now. Wow, well, come on, right, there you go. What are you doing?
fair enough. Okay, let's go inside. Atom, a branch of the Soviet army created long before the war, caused by the imperialist conquerors. Our mission does not end in gathering pre-war technology and reviving our Soviet motherland. We also strive to reach the pre-war quality of life for all. To realize those goals, we often send search expeditions into the wasteland. Not long ago, one of such expeditions, led by General Morozov, lost all contact with the base. Our human resources are limited. Therefore, the standard procedure is to send out but a few agents to investigate this problem. You are one of the chosen for this mission. General Morozov's troops had an important quest to locate, control, and study a secret bunker. Bunker 317. According to our data, it is located near the village of Otradnoya. To successfully complete your mission, we recommend you to contact our agent in the city of Krasnos Nemunye, codename Fidel. He's hiding in plain sight as a barkeep in the outskirts of the city. So apart from physical aid, he can offer you informational support as well. You will learn the password needed to contact our agent from the envelope. Destroy it upon reading. And remember, your mission is to gather intelligence on the disappearance of Morozov and his troops. No heroics. The wastes are a dangerous place. Good luck, cadet. And let there be atom. Would it be okay if I set up an atom? <laughs> Simpsons quote, no? Maybe. What a calm night. A bit too calm. Wait a second. What's that rustling sound? Wait a- oh, sorry. <laughs> a well-built man in his thirties emerges from the uneven shadow stands around your campfire. He's dressed in a musky, khaki uniform. Musty, sorry. Well, 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 what do we have here? Hope I'm not bothering you, comrade. The man stops before you and rubs his hands, as if to warm himself, or to off- Show off a formidable set of brass knuckles on his left hand. You look like a tourist, man. Nice tent, clean clothes without holes or tears, and so much other stuff. Man pulls all your equipment. Must be difficult carrying such a load of stuff around. You know, me and my pals could help you. Well, not for free, of course, but for a very reasonable price. What, what say you? Okay. What do you do? <laughs> Seriously. Let's try this one, will we? Listen, buddy, you obviously didn't catch my... What's it called again? Metaphor. Sharing is out of the question. Uh, why do I even bother? Time for you to lie down for a bit. Take the loot, man. We got ourselves a good catch tonight. Oh my head, those assholes robbed me blind. Or maybe they left something. <laughs> no, nothing at all. What's this? So we can save here, can we?
Okay, so that was Halt, who's there? Before you stand Before you stand strongly built man uh, of about thirty. He's wearing a weathered military jacket, holding a large gun. At a glance he seems like the affordable the affable sword, excuse me. Would probably welcome some conversation. He's absently chewing a blade of gla grass, but upon seeing you livens up a bit at once. Hey there, comrade. Hello to you too. Nice to meet you, my name is Yan. May I ask what brings you to our village? I'm looking for someone. Ask a few questions. Hmm. Whole squad passed through not long ago. Can't say for sure if they were military, but... There were uh, some serious <laughs> looking dudes among them. Nice weapons, bad attitudes. They even had uniforms of a sort. These guys are no joke, I tell you. They bought nice water rest of our denier walls and moved on. I got to chatting with them, one of them. Nice guy younger than the rest. He said they were on an expedition into the ruins. Probably searching for pre-war tech or what remains of it. God help them. They seemed normal enough. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Our tech I disappeared to somewhere. <laughs> Drinking wow. Let's see. How's life? Okay. Bandits come every month, each month, and to demand money. We tried fighting them, we tried making peace with them. Nothing works, they're too strong. And nobody can help you? We sent a man into Krasnaz... Um, Krasnaz or something once, to hire a few mercenaries. He took all the money we had, but it only, but it only bought seven men. They looked plenty serious and tough, with their fancy guns, proud. I wish I could tell you they drove off the, uh, the bandits or simply killed them, that the harassment stopped. I wish I could tell you that, but life in the wasteland is no fairy tale. Uh, the bandits killed all seven of them, and the following month the extortion fee went up. They said that since we obviously had money to pay for mercenaries, we could afford to pay more. Weapons here, nice, okay. That's great, thank you. Nothing on me at all. Before you sits a young woman, she is deep in concentration, writing in the yellowed notepad, notebook, with the word accounting on the uh, accounting on the cover. She is completely immersed in this activity and does not notice you. Okay. Hmm. 
<laughs> Before he stands a plump, red-faced man of around 25 with a neatly trimmed beard. He's wearing a white shirt with some rather short shorts. In his hands, there's a clean towel he uses to swat annoying flies. Upon seeing you, the man gives you a wide smile. Oh, a customer. Welcome to the tavern. You travellers sure keep on coming. Well, you're right here now. Not long ago, an armed bandit came to... Okay, guns... Suit menu. What have they got? I've no rubies or whatever it is. A prehistoric eight red. Okay, let's hear it. Fair enough. Okay. Oh, nice. Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Let's check our quest. Let's see. He rest. Any food, perhaps? <laughs> I want to talk with the chicken. Oh no, what is going on here? <laughs> oh no. Oh crap. They're all after me now. <laughs> I... Oh, please. I'm so sorry. <laughs> what did he do to deserve this? What? They're all after me. Not really necessary. And that's the end of the video. Wow. Did not expect that at all. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. <laughs> Whatever that was. <laughs> well, the end bit. But, uh... Well, so thank you to the Adam team for this early hands-on. I know that song. I feel like I know it. But yeah, this is coming out soon, this week, if I'm correct. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so you can check us out on YouTube and Twitter. And for more Nintendo and Indies, keep it right here at IGS. Alright guys, see you soon. Bye-bye.